Fresno State mechanical engineering professor and founder of CEO of 5 Microns, Dr. Tay Leo Nguyen, develops tremor suppression technology to help people with Parkinson's and essential tremor. Along with Fresno State graduate Skritan Rujarahu, they are in the final stages of developing tremor suppression technology to assist Parkinson's patients with day-to-day -day tasks and improve their quality of life while limiting the need for heavy doses of medication or medical procedures. Um, since my childhood, I observed uh, people with uh, tremor problems on their hands, their arm, their body. Uh, from various reasons, somebody actually veterans from the war, Vietnam War, um, somebody's unknown, but um, I saw them having a hard time doing things with their tremor. Um, so not, not knowing much what causes those, but growing up, read more and see more people and then read more about the causes. Uh, so I noticed that Parkinson disease uh, are the, the cause of the tremor and also essential tremor, another very popular, not popular, common um, movement disorder, um, probably the most common movement disorder in the world. 2.2% of people living with the essential tremor, uh, where tremor is the, the main symptoms of that movement disorder. Uh, I went to uh, two, three professors and I went to Dr. Nguyen as well. And right away he said, okay, I have some project uh, for you. So, and uh, he just explained the project and I felt so happy. And I felt so extremely happy because of two reasons. I am uh, I'm getting some project, what I need to work on and uh, which is my interesting field. At the same time, the project is really very interesting. So, and that's a kind of unique project. It's not like a uh, regular project which everybody can do. And uh, I'm always fortunate to be involved in this project and I'm grateful to that. <laughs> Dr. Wynn and Skritong were able to demonstrate how their device works. Um, so our device is wearable on the hand and arms using no electrical uh, power at all. Mm and totally non-invasive. So comparing to medications, which only about 50%, 60% of effective to any, uh, any patient that, uh, that that one works for. For essential tremor, unfortunately about 40% that don't get response from uh, medications, I mean they don't have anything to help them. Um, for deep brain stimulation, which is surgery um, kind of methods, it's very invasive, it takes a lot of time people have to be qualified at, uh, with certain health conditions to, to be done on it. Um, very limited number of people actually can get that uh, treatment. So with people that we dial medications to help, we dial the option to do surgery, uh, they need something to control their trauma in their hands to do ability. So we think that our device is um, one of the solutions to help with that. And compared to other ZIS device, our can actually address the severe tremor level, while other may be good for mild or moderate. I could see so much improvement. You could see it with my hands. It just, I would love to have one when they go with it because it just so embarrassing when I go out to eat and my hands are shaking and everything. And this helps so much when I eat. It's just like I don't spill stuff and nothing. Uh, this is the best thing I've ever had before. Um, so that's our process. Um, we in for the next few months we gonna improve the efficacies of the product, improve the um, product outlook, the appearance, um, and setting up the manufacturing plan operations to produce in uh, higher quantity to uh, to start offering to the general public so that uh, patients can can actually buy and use it in their households. This is Jose Romo Jr. with the Fresno State Collegian.